Merlin Otte, so disappointing in the World Championships, two bronze medals in the individual events. But since, in Cologne last Sunday, ran 21.83 for 200 metres, the race she's running tonight, the fastest time in the world this year. And she's got Perek, a France outsider, in lane number five. The gold medalist in the 400 metres, dropping down in distance. The full lineup: Alan of Cuba in one, Cuthbert, Jamaica in two, Torrance, United States in three, Otti in four, Perek in five, Privalova of the Soviet Union in six, and in lane seven, Pauline Davis of the Bahamas. A big threat too from Gwen Torrance, uh, just behind Otti. Torrance, the world number three, 22.16 this year, silver medalist in the world championships in both 100 and 200, and she beat Otti in both those races. The baby in 89, beat Crabber in the 100 metres on Sunday in Cologne, now 26. The lineup again Alan Cuba, Cuthbert, Jamaica, Torrance, United States, Otti, Jamaica, Perek of France, Prevalova of the Soviet Union, and in lane number seven. Pauline Davis, Bahamas. Second, third and fourth in the World Championships here. Only Krabber, the champion, missing. Perek, 23. French champion, number one French woman, 100 metres, 200 metres and 400 metres. This, the 200 metre final. Good smooth start, and in fact, Perrick was better away than Otti, but Otti's really the better man, and it's Otti at the moment going away from Perrick, and also going away from Torrance and Pavalova on the Soviet Union on the outside. But Otti, the world number one on the clock, trying to demonstrate that tonight, and she seems to be doing it. Torrance in second place, quite a way back, and third Pavalova, and uh, Otti streams home in front. Torrance in second place, Pavalova third, and the time 21.65 way way inside the world best this year and a new commonwealth record if that is right 21 6 4 has now been corrected to and the wind is allowable the fastest time in the world this year and suddenly the girl who was to be the golden girl and didn't come good in the world championships two bronze medals in the individual events is back at her very best and looking very much what she is the world number one this was a great demonstration of sprinting. Perrick was slightly away better, but that's all. Pravalova probably got the best start of the red of the Soviet Union. Watch Grant Torrance trying to hold Otti, but Otti's bend here is absolutely superb. She destroys the uh, French 400 meter gold medalist, who just drops right out of it. Pravalova's a slight threat, so too is Torrance. But coming off the bend, real acceleration again as she comes into the straight. Now away she goes. This is sprinting at its very best. Torrance, just for a moment, looked as if she might peg her back, but there was no weakening in front. That was the important thing. So what went wrong in the World Championships is the big question. A new Commonwealth record, unofficially, at 21.64, the fastest time in the world this year. Merlin, that was the second fastest time ever, and it looks so easy tonight. Well, I'm very glad that I was able to come back after Tokyo and to perform so well. All year long I wanted a PR and I'm glad I have a chance to run the fast today. Talking about Tokyo, you must have been very disappointed. Did you have a specific problem there or what? Yes, I was very disappointed. I lost all Tokyo due to the bad start in the 100 meters. I just couldn't come back mentally 4200 and that just ruined all my competition. Well, you were so dominant early on in the season and you said that you had a chance maybe of breaking the world record. Do you have enough races left this season to have a go at it? I only have two more races and they're not in the 200 metres. They're the 100 metres. I thought in Tokyo, if I'd run a better 100 metres and the weather was great, then it's possible I could do it there. The track was fast. What about the 100 metres? Because that world record really is outstanding, but you still consider 200 to be your best event? Yes, um, but if the win is a plus win in Barcelona in the Grand Prix Finals, then I should come close, I believe. What about next year? Do you plan to the Olympics? Oh yes, I will um, run less competitions, find more time for training, and I will be better prepared, more mental prepared for the Olympics. Is it still world records that are important, or is it gold medals? Right now with gold medals, uh, if I could win Barcelona, then that would be a plus. I believe the world record will come when you're not least, when you're not focusing on it, you will get there. 
you feel more relaxed and you think the performance will come? Yes, I think that, that way they'll come and you will run a fast time. It's not a bad end to your season though. Oh, yeah, I'm very glad, no, 21-6 at the end of the, the last 20 meter for the year. I'm very happy. Congratulations. Thank you.